it can fly, we see it here. Um, they all come, and they come from all over the world. Our operations yesterday were 2,275, so that's right up there with what O'Hare does in a 24-hour period. We did that in half the time yesterday. Your first one's on final right now. But they, every one of them, including our rookie controllers, were journeyman controllers back in their home facility where they work year-round. So they're all journeyman controllers. They're all really, they're in that best of the best category. And so uh, they're concentrating really hard every minute that they're there. Everybody's a pair of eyes. Experience level is, is, is doesn't matter. It, we're all equal partners. If you see something, we're encouraged to say something. They work departures only out near the runways, and they're, that's why they wear the pink shirt, so that they're visible. So we're in the town of Fisk. We're located about six miles southwest of uh, Whitman Regional Airport in Oshkosh. At two approaching Fisk, one is low, one is high. The low one, we're gonna go runway niner. We are actually communicating with every pilot coming up this way, and we will balance the workload to the two main runways at Whitman Airport from here. Going the east-west road for You're flying in a more congested airspace than most people are familiar with. You're a lot closer to people than you're you're generally familiar with, and. Uh, you need to be kind of on your game more than other at other airports. For me, that's part of the fun of Oshkosh is that it's one of the most fast-paced and um, demanding environments that you can ever fly into. So I, I really enjoy that challenge. Monitor Tower on 